So I want to point something out because he brought this up after the camera was off and it's a really good point. Uh, the reason I forced there is because I thought that the Ancestral Recall is the card he put on top of the deck. He's right, it makes sense that I, since Key was out, I go for Time Vault, but because the quality of Ancestral Recall is so good, for it to be the other random card in his hand just seemed so unlikely to me that I went to force it, thinking that the other one might have been like a paradoxical outcome without enough mana, or something like that. Or just something that wasn't as relevant. For it to be the spare card in that situation just seems so unlikely to me. But, of course, I ended up getting punished for it. Oops. Yeah. And in all likelihood, knowing his luck, if he resolves Recall, he's gonna find three Force of Will anyway. <laughs> so... <laughs> that... I was gone regardless. <laughs> Would you not, my friend? Would you not? Mr. I had five Force of Wills that game. Five, and I cast four of them. <laughs> I cast three. You cast... You, well, you flushed your store was the other counter I did. No, you did... It was a Force a of Will... Pitching Force. Force, Pitch, Force. And, and then a Force, force Pitch, pitching, Brainstorm. No, and later you had another pitched, Force before snap. you Time Twistered. I pitched Snap on that one. You later had a Force of Will. Yeah, yeah. that I pitched something else to. You did Force, Pitch, Force, Force, Pitch, Brainstorm, Force, Pitch, Snap. No. Then you Time Twistered. Because I kept Brainstorm in because that was what I tutored for. Well, we can see on that tape. <laughs> Wow, this is a hand. This is a hand. I will keep. Okay, yeah, this is... Uh, I'll keep. I, I feel bad for doing this. Kind of. Um, we're gonna go Mana Crypt. Mm -hmm. Time Vault. Yeah. Oh, tapped. <laughs> Comes in tapped. Okay. That's important. Um, and then we're going to cross our fingers, I guess. Pass turn. Sure. Yeah, wh where's a land? Who needs a land? Land. Fault. Uh, yeah. Key. Okay. Two floating. Uh, wait, wait, I got a response. Oh, to key? Uh, to, to, uh, time vault. Which is, we're going to force pitching thought cast. Okay. Go ahead. You stay tapped. That's not how that works. Full take key? Yeah, you will. Okay. So, that doesn't count. That game does not count. That's not... That's not enough. Oh my goodness. Well, so that happened. I didn't have the mana to untap. Yeah. My and, oh, no, not that. Vault that turn anyway. I actually thought about not countering the time vault there because... If I let it resolve, I still win the game next turn anyway. Yeah. I probably should not have done it the way that I did it. Um, do as I say, not as I do, kids. Why is this not going away? Oh my god, it's frozen. Error. Yeah, yeah, I'll, I can see that. Error. 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 I, I, I... All right, my friend. I am ready for round whatever we're up to now, like 81... <laughs> I don't even know. All right. Woo! The GP Nashville mat versus the GP DC mat. Oh, yeah. I All have right. a couple of Charlotte ones somewhere, and then I got one from Atlanta last year. <laughs> okay. Fair enough. Let's see. Get another one in a couple of weeks. Actually, not even that. Going to Atlanta? Yeah. You and me both. Won't be able to compete. But, I can go. No. I'm doing side events. That's right. That's why I went ahead and bought the Lily on this instead of getting my And you are on the here. play, right? Yes. Um, this is awkward, but I think I want to keep. I'm going to regret this, but I think I want to keep. So while you're shuffling, let me show what's going on. Kaiba, what's going on? Okay, cool. We have this, but you notice there's something in there that's a little awkward here. We have this, but you know, that's a thing. <laughs> and then all of these. This is why I'm keeping, ultimately. Ta-da! If I absolutely need to, we can go that route. Yeah. Four, four, 
force of will. Se <laughs> 72 force of wills. <laughs> when I get to heaven, 72 force of wills. <laughs> That's the correct translation of that passage. Well, 72 that was actually seven, but still wasn't keepable. Oh, it's okay. <laughs> we're we're gonna let you, since this is casual. I'm just gonna say six and a half again. Yeah, I don't care if it's going to <laughs> bite me, and you're gonna get a handful of force of wills. It's for the principle of it. It's by, it's for the principle. And the principle is magic is fun. <laughs> And in the meantime, strengthen these fingers of mine. I will be able to open any pickle jar. <laughs> There's something seismic going on over here. <laughs> All right, there we go. T1 Glister of Learned Seismic Toss. <laughs> Okay, okay, I'm gonna put a limit. This is the last six and a half you get. <laughs> well, that time it was just three chrome boxes. Oh, oh, that hurts. I think it was chrome, the legendary chrome. Oh, mox opal? Yes. Oh, yeah. Three mox opals. A little, little awkward there. So, even worse, three mox opal and no other mox in Orland. I mean, it looked pretty until <laughs> I saw that my other artifacts were <laughs> the same as my first one. Fair enough. And there's just no keeping that one for any kind of silly jankness yeah. at all. All right, well, <laughs> six and a half, take three, action. Th this is actually your hand. Whatever that, that was I just gave you, that's your hand. I'll stop. Sorry. I can't even keep this. What? Okay, sh show that off, please. L because he's right, he can't keep it. But what on earth is going on? <laughs> I mean, who in their right mind would keep a hand with zero lands, zero moxen, and no way to make mana on the first turn? Wait. Okay. Ooh. You know what? Fine. Six and a half again. <laughs> I'm a glutton for punishment. Yes, you are. <laughs> This, this is what? <laughs> this is... You're one for four. Yes, I'm one for four, <laughs> and letting you letting go... Actually, one for five, so you're one in four. Yeah, well, oh, across the day... <laughs> one. In, yeah, I've lost 80% of my games today. In my defense, one of them was letting you do this... <laughs> a bunch of times. Yeah, I'm not meaning to. No, you're right. <laughs> and having... The one game that I win happens to have dueling time machines. <laughs> for some reason. This is a thing for some reason. Sadly, mine was a turn one time machine without any way to start it. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, here we go. Last six and a half. I swear, this is the last one. Okay, I can keep this. Okay. Okay. <sighs> So, after all of that, here you go. Petal Pearl? Yeah. Okay, cool. Academy. To nothing with. Pastor. What kind of a person would keep that hand? This kind of a person. Okay, okay. Go. Just tell me how you feel. Let it all out. Opal? Yeah. The loneliest opal. Pass turn. Okay. Yeah. Counterspell. Okay. Go. Okay. 
Oh my god. I need to move to discard. No, 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 no. Oh my god, Jay. Oh my god. You are an idiot. You are an imbecile. You're, you're crazy, dog. You're crazy. I'm hurt. Don't ask if I'm all right. Did you forget something last turn? It's fine. I'll, I'll make it work. All right. Make one mana. Mm -hmm. Soul ring. Make two mana. Mana vault, one floating. Um... Voltaic Key is what I'll spend the floating mana on. Alright, make sure I don't mess this up. I have a feeling I'm about to if I'm not careful here. Blue. Mm -hmm. Three floating. Mm -hmm. Spend one of it, untap the Mox Opal. Mm -hmm. Two floating and blue. Blue, so two blue, two colorless. I very much need to resolve Vidalkin Archmage. Force, pitching, how many cards do you have in hand? Two. Windfall. Yep. And you know what Windfall does? No. All right, it's banned in Legacy, long story short. So we both just went to 19 here. Oh, okay. Absolutely. It's much more potent when you're on the play and the other person has seven cards in hand. You can yeah. basically dump your hand and then go back to seven. Mm -hmm. um, in any case, I will now pass the turn. And we're both at 19. You goody. Wait. Okay. Hmm? Oh, balance. Balance. How many cards again? Two. Two. So we keep the same number of cards in hand, the same number of lands. The only thing is I'd lose my creature. I'm never going to go off of you, buddy. <laughs> this is apparently a thing. It's a curse of mine that I'm never going to end up going off with Archmage. All right. Nothing else changes, just he's sacked. Because we have same cards, same lands. Three? Yep. Key. Sure. Use one. Yep. Pass turn. All right. Vault trigger on mm -hmm. the step. Or no, no, this is upkeep. That doesn't trigger till draw step. Right. Which means you're still tapped right now. Yeah. I'm. I'm thinking. I'm thinking how I want to do this. see we can go blue two spin one of it untap the soul ring untap the mana vault three okay so let me let me start that over because I, I want to do that with more with clearer visuals doing it better uh, blue mm -hmm. two tap key so uh, colorless and blue mm -hmm. untap mana vault mm -hmm. make three right. Not that it's about to matter in a second here. I'll spin blue and three, leaving one colorless floating. Outcome. Uh, sack for blue. Okay. Three. Force. Okay, spin the one colorless, and one, two, three, four, hard cast force back. Okay. okay. So we had the same idea. I, that's kind of cool, actually. <laughs> the one floating did matter. Doing the mana vault there did make a difference. And this is all in upkeep, so... And I'll draw four. Um, finally, I will resolve one of these. And maybe, just maybe, I can do something with this game. Although I did have to tap my academy, so... Victory for you there. Now I would like to go to draw. Mm -hmm. You have no cards in hand? Right. Alright. Whale. Whale. Hmm. And you have nothing floating I'm, now? I'm still gonna... I have nothing floating. Yeah. Uh, Gitaxian Probe, look at your hand. Eh. Yeah. Draw a card. Eh. It's a very technical magic term, by the way. Eh. Okay. So. No Archmage. 
Rip. <laughs> I wonder who did that. Yeah, I wonder. Opal. Mm -hmm. Okay, I think we can do this. I If I don't mess this up, I think that we can do this. We're going to go Scalding Tarn, Fetch, mm -hmm. go to 16, get an island. I said, I, I pronounced it get for some reason, as if it's spelled G-H-E-T. Not sure why I do that. These playtesting games have been really instructive because there's a card in this deck that has actually not shown up the entire time. I'm wondering, now granted I haven't won too many games so that might be why, I'm wondering how useful that is and whether I should replace it with something else. Okay, so, so, we are going to go, once again, Soul Ring, mm -hmm. um, Float One, Mana Vault, Voltaic Key, three mana, mm -hmm. and blue, spend one of the colorless mana to untap the Mox Opal. Wait a minute. We don't have to do that. We can actually do the... Okay. You are not... Okay, so I spent... That's correct. So, Soul Ring, cast Mana Vault, and Voltaic Key. Nothing's floating. Nothing's floating anymore. In that case, Mox Opal in three, so blue in three. Mm -hmm. Tinker? Okay. I mean... And you know where this is going. There's one floating, right? There's one floating for the key. Yeah, that's right. So time vault. Yeah. Yeah. Well, okay. So this has been a game. I really want to get Archmage to ever show up, but apparently it's just not in the cards. Uh, apparently. <sighs> uh, one. One bonus game, please. I, I I need to play with Archmage. I need him to actually show up. You have the dirtiest <laughs> mind. Okay, so we're gonna YouTube. We are doing something a little different. You'll notice he and I have one card. Um, I am trying to make this deck go off with Vidalk and Archmage. It has not happened yet because every time it keeps getting countered or killed or something. <laughs> so he and I both have one card, and we're actually about to draw six, so seven altogether. That way we will have a hand that at least can try to go off with that one card. And if it works, great. If not, well, I I don't know. I'm, I'm trying to record a game of the deck doing what it's supposed to do. So here are my six. One, two, six, and then all seven all together. Okay. Mmm. Oh, uh, yeah, I hear you. No water. I'll keep. I can't, but sure. You you can't, but sure. Okay, that's reassuring. Huh. Well, I'm gonna draw something. I'll be a little bit better. You know, the whole purpose of this was to start off with that card in our hand so we would actually cast it, and yet what I think is the ideal play for me involves ditching that card. <laughs> My goodness, this is... Why does this keep happening to me, man? Why does this keep happening to me? Do you even play Magic, bro? I know, right? Um, actually, we're gonna do... Uh, Flooded Strand, Fetch, get an island... Stifle. Oh my god. The zero mana stifle is real. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to vintage, motherfucker. <laughs> deck Faden walks in. Surprise, motherfucker. So now all of a sudden, Deck Faden is... Yes. I can't even think of his name. I Samuel can't L. either. Jackson. I don't think that's who it was in the show, in Dexter. Oh. Alright, so we're gonna do Mox Ruby, Mox Jet. Windfall. 
Do you know what this card does? Discard a hand, draw seven? Yep. A draw card's equal to the number of cards. It'll be seven in this case because you have seven cards yeah. in hand. All right, results? Uh, okay, cool. There's my Archmage. Rip Archmage, but then again, also rip your outcome. Four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. Maybe there'll be another one in here. Or not. <laughs> or not. You fudging, fudging, fudger. I didn't mean to. This is just how it happens, man. <laughs> You're fudging, fudger. Okay, well, I, I wear that mantle proudly, <laughs> I suppose. Uh, I will play an opal. Hmm. Pass turn. Switch feet over here, just, just quickly. Chromox imprint thirst. Okay. Blue. No. Ah. Ah. Uh, mental misstep. Fudge you. No. Okay. Draw. Mm -hmm. I would like to repeal my own Mox Opal. Alright. Draw a card. <sighs> I would like to, and I'm glad I get to. I know, I know. Mox Opal. Mm -hmm. Black Lotus. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four. I would like to cast Paradoxical Outcome. Mm -hmm. Mother, may I? Okay. Um, Paradoxical gives me four cards. These four. And one, two, three, four. I still haven't found another one. You're in here somewhere, buddy. Okay. Um, before I get too far along, Sapphire? Mm -hmm. Ponder? Yep. Oh my god. It's fine. I'm just not finding the one card I really want to find in here. That's all it is. Nothing else. Um, it's not great anyway, so I am going to shuffle. It's okay. There's two mana rocks and a top, but top is less good when you already can see two of the cards from Ponder anyway. So, eh. And maybe I should have if I'm playing past this turn. Alright. Here you go, bro. Well, okay. I guess that's a thing. Um, Academy? Mm-hmm. Opal, Ruby, Jet. Pass turn. Maybe somewhat oddly. Ooh. But at least we have seven cards in hand, so it's the maximum without having to discard. Uh, mental misstep. Go. I'm sorry, dude. I, I can't. Can't let you do that, Star Fox. I would like to cast Brainstorm. Yeah. This is not even remotely hard. 
Make sure I put the sleeves in the right direction. That's important. That's a thing. Okay, man. <laughs> Okay. Well, good news is we have a fetch land. Brainstorm plus fetch land equals winning is what I'm going with. Okay. I would like to play a Black Lotus. Mm -hmm. Chrome Mox, imprinting I mean, do I even... Yeah... Hmm... <laughs> I... It, it is better in the end if I... No, no, I'll, I'll keep it this way. Chrome Ox for the sake of Chrome Ox. Uh, my friend, I would like to... Cast... Oh, which ones do I do? Which ones do I do? Alright, these, I suppose. I would like to cast a Time Twister. Yeah. Okay. Whee! Alright. Time Twister is being a little boss. A little bit of a boss over here. Uh, I have Force of Will in hand. I could have pitched Force of Will, imprinted it on Chrome Mox, and when I Time Twister, it makes me less likely to have Force, which on the one hand means I'm less likely to have interaction, but on the other hand, more likely to find more combo pieces. So that one could go either way. Since you're getting seven cards, I think it's okay to have another Force of Will accidentally. I think I can live with that. All right, my friend. Here you go. Give you uh, one... Two cuts, two slices, and then what seven am I going to get? This is all a turn. Welcome to Vintage. One turn. Um, sure. I'll keep. <laughs> That's how this works. Alright, so now I would like to Mox Pearl. Mm -hmm. I would like to tap it for Voltaic Key. Sure. Since mental missteps a thing, I, I needed to ask, I suppose. Um, let's see. Four mocks and walk into a bar. One. And then the lotus. I don't want to now. Let's see, if I don't, it's one, two, and I don't have enough. So I, I do need to pop the lotus here or come up with something clever, really clever. Uh, yeah, we're, we're unfortunately, we're fortunate, it doesn't matter, we're gonna pop the lotus here. For blue, make blue here. I would like to cast Paradoxical Outcome. Or Pitch Tizzy. Pact of Negation. Yep. So, I will set a marker on my deck, <laughs> because this is about to get ugly if somehow I fail to go off here. No, it's fine. I have the mana to pay for it. I just need to not forget. So now, all of this... And yeah, I could have done the Academy instead of popping the Lotus. This makes more mana than Lotus now, strangely enough. Okay, so this is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And now I will draw 7 cards. Only <laughs> forget, sing, see, sit. Okay. Who needs Vidalcan Archmage, apparently? Apparently. Uh, the answer, I suppose, is I do. So. What's the best way to do I have played a land, I just haven't cracked it yet. Which, I think I'm about to now. Finally, getting on with it over here. Okay. 
Let me make sure one more time I don't have a ponder or brainstorm before I do. There we go. Lose a life. Get an Island. One turn. I'm sorry, dude. I, I'm having fun. I know this must not feel great when you're F6, but... Um, I've just not had anything at all. I'm, I'm like, sorry, I've dude. had to big on off that. Okay. So I need to do the, mi the bare minimum that would let me play the rest of this. Which is to say... Uh, a Mox Sapphire, a Mox Pearl, a Mox Jet, four mana. Mm -hmm. I would like to cast Vidalkin Archmage. Please, okay, okay, we're, you have uh, cards in hand, but presumably not a... Okay, so there we go. Now we get to start doing shenanigans. Finally, uh, Mox Ruby, draw mm -hmm. a card. But you're forced to draw so you can actually kill yourself. You can time. actually kill yourself, that is correct. Mox Opal, draw a card. Let's see. Um, let's see. Mox Opal, targeting it. it repeal, targeting Mox Opal. Mm -hmm. Draw a card. Let's see. Hmm. I think it's fine now I can actually maybe tap the academy. I, I should wait for a little bit longer. Uh, Opal, draw a card. Oh my goodness. This is a thing, I guess. Um, Emerald, draw a card. Mm hmm Chrome Mox, uh, I, I will imprint this time. I will imprint a mental misstep onto it. Mm -hmm. Draw a card. Tap four. Vidalkin Archmage. Mm -hmm. Tap for one, two, three, four, five, five, six, seven. Um, Let's do Voltaic Key. Draw two cards. Mm -hmm. Chromox, no imprint. Draw two cards. Uh, Voltaic Key. Draw two cards. Still five floating. Um, I'm, I'm. Paradoxical Outcome. Mm -hmm. All right, goodbye, mental misstep. All right, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Draw ten cards. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All upside down for some reason. Okay. Mox Opal, draw two cards. And there was one floating, by the way, from the outcome. Because I made seven, cast two keys, and outcome. So there's one more left. Um, let's see. Mox Emerald, draw two cards. Okay, where are you? You're in here. You're, you're near the back, I think, as I recall. Uh, using that mana... I, I know I saw you in here. Oh, there you are. Laboratory Maniac. Mm -hmm. Floating and then using that t the two. Okay. Um, Ruby, Jet, Pearl, Sapphire. Draw eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Chrome Mox for yeah. nothing. Draw Laboratory Mania. Uh, yeah. Um, that is a thing. That is how this deck is intended to run. Uh, Archmage, and it can win off Maniac or Time Vault or Time Machine. 
Um, believe it or not, Time Machine on its own may not actually be enough because if your only win con is Time Machine, you don't actually have a win con. You need something to close out the game. Mm -hmm. I don't have Tinker Blightsteel. I don't have um, Brain Freeze. And so if I took out Maniac, I'd replace it with one of those, which I very well might. Um, but Laboratory Maniac or Snapcaster Beats or something. Um, but yeah, that's that's how this deck is supposed to run. Um, janky, that's how.